Viewmont High School, Bountiful, Utah. Nestled in the middle of Davis County lies Viewmont High School, home of the Vikings. It seems like an ordinary school on the outside, however it does have a haunted history with one of the most notorious serial killers ever to walk the earth. On November 8, 1974, Theodore Ted Bundy attempted to kidnap a young woman by the name of Carol Durange. He lured her to the parking lot at Fashion Place Mall in Murray, Utah, where he overpowered her, slapped some handcuffs on her, and shoved her into his car. She managed to open the car door and jump out. Immediately after this failed attempt, he drove to Viewmont High School in Bountiful. Deborah Jean Kent, who was 17 years old at the time, was leaving the theater production in the school auditorium to pick up her younger brother. People remember seeing her walking out towards the parking lot, and also remember seeing a sharply dressed man who was acting suspiciously. He was pacing back and forth outside of the auditorium. As the night went on, Deborah Kent never returned. Her body was also never found. Bundy was later caught after his VW bug he was driving was stopped for a traffic violation. The police noticed that his passenger seat was missing. After further investigation, gloves, rope, a ski mask, handcuffs, trash bags, and an ice pick were found in his vehicle. Bundy was eventually tried and convicted for other murders. While on his deathbed minutes away from execution, he admitted finally to murdering Deborah Jean Kent. He told investigators where the body was. However, they were only able to find a leg bone and were not able to tie it to Miss Kent. Students and faculty have reported seeing apparitions around the theater area of Viewmont High School. They've also seen the ghost being drugged through the parking lot. Other people have reported seeing Ted's VW bug in the parking lot. These apparitions and viewings become more frequent the closer to November 8th we get.